Greetings, Daniel Presedo for Adobe Photoshop. And today we're going to start a unique series that goes through the 3D menu. I'm going to go through each of these items to help you get started using Photoshop 3D. Move Object to Ground Plane is a fantastic menu command. It allows you to place objects that you select, for example, in the 3D scene, immediately on the ground. I'm going to select this cone object, go to the 3D menu, Move Object to Ground Plane. It places on what Photoshop knows as an a ground plane. It's an invisible ground plane that Photoshop has here. That's what's catching the shadows and allows you to immediately align the objects. So you don't have to do all that work and try to figure out what it is. So I can select multiple objects and do that same command. I can even select it not only in the 3D menu here, move object to ground plane, but I can go to the properties panel, select the coordinates, and there is a button here that says move to ground plane. Now, if you select multiple objects, in this case the sphere and ring, it will take the one that is closest to the bottom and align that to the ground first. So in this case, I'll actually have to select the sphere again, and if I want it aligned on the ground, press the button again and it's aligned. Another similar case is, I've imported this model from Mixamo. It's an animated model, but I want it to align it on this tablecloth. And I can tell that the shadow is way off, and this object is perfectly fine where it is. But now I have to select it and move it up move to ground plane. I can select the button here in the 3D panel again. Or of course, as we're showing you, the menu command. Move all object to ground plane. There we go. And now I can see that he was really way off there. I can select the entire camera by clicking on the canvas here. See the gold box? And then drag and move down the scene. And it's closer aligned to what I was trying to achieve. So that is 3D menu, move object to ground plane. Hope that was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them on the channel. And thank you for watching.